Economies program of the International Monetary Fund is an entry point for young economists after they complete their graduate studies. How many do we hire? About 30 a year from universities and countries across the world. From the day you join, you are an economist working on real economic issues that will have an impact on any one of our 187 member countries. If you're looking for an exciting international career, the IMF's Economist Program would interest you. I decided to join the Economist Program because I think the IMF provides a neat set of opportunities to gain hands-on experience as operational economists with uh, very strong analytical elements. The work of the IMF is uh, one of the most relevant for people who are interested in macroeconomic policy. Um, its work uh, matters hugely for different countries. Uh, it advice carries a lot of weight and its knowledge, the knowledge in the institution, is very up to date. The fund has always been a prime institution for anybody interested in macroeconomics. I decided to join the Economist program because I really wanted to learn about the economic problems and challenges facing different countries. I also wanted to enhance my knowledge on policy issues and the EP program is the best place to achieve that objective. I wanted to contribute in the fight against poverty and inequalities, especially in emerging and developing countries, by helping in the design and implementation of some policies that would be conducive of higher and uh, sustainable growth. Working in a central bank at the onset of the latest financial crisis, which exposed the macrofinancial linkages, the global nature of the macrofinancial linkages, reinforced this interest and made me decide to apply to the fund. I started out take, with an academic job, but soon realized I wanted to be more policy-oriented and hands-on, and um, I joined the fund a year later and haven't looked back since. I had a great experience at the fund as a summer intern right before I finished my PhD. I learned how economic policies are made in practice and how valuable our recommendations can be for policymakers. The most exciting moments were when I could feel my work was having real impact. Engaging the authorities in very interesting discussions on policy issues, uh, I also got a chance to train government officials in the Middle East, and for me that was such a rewarding experience to give something back to the region. It was great to participate in policy discussions with country authorities and assist them in exploring options for a timely and appropriate response to the crisis. Only four months into the fund, I found myself on a plane to North Africa where my mission chief and I were supposed to provide tailored technical assistance on financial sector surveillance. I think what we're looking for in uh, EP uh, candidates, uh, first of all initiative, the ability to communicate, and also the willingness to approach new issues and new challenges beyond your immediate field of PhD studies. You can make a difference by applying what you learn at school to real-world issues. A sound understanding of how to translate research into relevant policy questions is highly appreciated as well. Go to the IMF website and check out our latest publications such as the staff position notes and the working papers. That will give you an idea about the current hot issues in the fund, which are likely to be raised in the EP interviews. The strangest thing that has happened to me in the fund was to undergo a panel interview less than one week before I gave birth to my son. I still wonder how the panel could concentrate on what I was saying while my then son-to-be was playing soccer in my gigantic belly. Local staff told me that my Japanese last name represents a running monkey in Swahili. That was very funny. Earlier this year, during the FIFA World Cup, uh, an internal website was set up for the staff to stream and watch the games on their office computers. Maybe it was not so much strange as pleasantly surprising. I met and married my wife here. Now may, you may ask why is it strange? I mean, really we went to the same undergraduate program 15 years ago. We took more or less the same courses, but we never really knew each other. It took us 15 years to meet again and we met here, we got married.